Hello everyone, just wanted to jump on here and share just an encouraging word to nonprofit leaders who are, you're trying, you know, you're out here, you're trying to do your programs, you're trying to get the funding that you need, you're trying to... You're, you're trying to get the support that you need, to be honest. And I just think at the end of the day, like, you, when you start looking at everybody else on Facebook and you start paying attention to what other people are doing, you really have to stop focusing on others and you have to focus on yourself. Focus on your program. Focus on your why. Focus on why you started. Why did you start your nonprofit? Why do you invest in the amount of money that you put into your nonprofit. You know what I'm saying? Like, why do you tell that story with so much passion that makes people want to, you know, give you $5 or $100 or $1,000? Like, when you find yourself getting discouraged, you have to start focusing focusing on yourself and stop looking at everybody else and stop looking at what they're doing. And you have to believe in yourself. The most important thing that you can ever do as a nonprofit leader, believe in yourself. Believe in the magic of you getting it done and you taking care of business. Because at the end of the day, you are the face of this nonprofit. You are the strategist. You are the person that people go to when they need to know about animals, when they need to know about children, when they need to know about ministry. You're the reason why. People call you, you know what I'm saying? And sometimes as a nonprofit leader, because I'm a, I'm an executive director, even though I'm a consultant, it, the most important thing that you can do for yourself, you have to focus on who you are and what, you know, and focus on wh- why, are, why are so many people attracted to my nonprofit? Why are so many people wanting to know what we're doing? And once you figure out that magic sauce, I promise you, your story's going to become better. Your funding will increase because you're going to know how to communicate with your donors. You're going to be able to know how to communicate with your board of directors. You're going to even know how to communicate with um, when you write a grant program. So at the end of the day, you have to be willing to believe in yourself. Stop paying attention to everybody else. Focus on you. Focus on why you're so amazing. Focus on the extraordinary power that you have when you're up 3 o'clock, 4 o'clock in the morning working on this thing. Focus on why you have that 9 to 5 that's funding your, you know, funding your bills. And if, you know, think about like all the extra or the additional time that you put into making this thing work. People need you. People want to believe in you. And people want to believe in something that's real. And you're that real. You know, you're that something real. So I just wanted to come on here and just give you a word of encouragement. And just let you know, stop focusing on other people. Focus on you. And your programs, your um, your stories, your funding will increase. The value of who you are will increase. And everything that you need will take care of itself, okay? So... That's my message. And I hope everybody has a great resurrection weekend. I know some people celebrate Easter. I call it resurrection weekend because that is the reason why we observe this actual moment. But yeah, just wanted to take the time out. Hey, Keandra, how are you? And just give y'all a word of encouragement. Keep doing what you're doing. We all need it. I mean... I'm running a nonprofit. I'm working full time and I'm also helping people start your nonprofit. So, you ever want to know how you can get in touch with me or how I can support you or even just ask me questions? I don't mind. You can go to alanaknowsnonprofits.com or you can hit me up on my fan page and I will get back to you as quickly as possible. So, have a happy resurrection weekend and I hope you enjoy spending time with your family and all that and all the blessings that you can. Uh, accomplish this weekend okay talk to you later bye bye